What are you doing? We gave them some Nutri Drench and we're giving them one quart each of the milk replacer, Farina 2220. Um, they've been responding really well. It's been three days. Is that right? A what? Since they've been here. I've been here so much, I really don't. <laughs> Three times a day, every day. I don't know. I think you got them like last Thursday or something. Yeah, I have to look. Let's see. It's almost gone. Um, they came. They had scours. I've given. I know I've given them three days worth of the medicine um, for scours, and um, that's every eight hours giving it, to, or every twelve hours giving it to them. Um, she's like, I want more. They always want more. All right, that's enough. You can put that one down there. Just put it in the green bucket. Um, they do not like the drench. <laughs> I stuck it in a nipple and was just going to let her drink it out. And she started spitting and flapping her tongue out and shaking her head. It was, <laughs> she was like, that is disgusting. And I, I tried it with him, and I, I got probably two thirds of the syringe in before he like opened his mouth and like ah, let it come out. But um, I think oh, you want to hurt him? One of them had a bloody mouth one day. I think it was her from. Oh, I think he did. Look, it's red. You busted his lip, you meanie. I oh, know that's that drench. <laughs> but she had like a little blood coming out from popping each other like that. I think she hurt her mouth on the bottle. But, um, yeah, they do not like the drench, so I'm going to have to force it down, uh, force them to get a little down, and then, um, give them the bottle after. But, uh, they, uh, I'm giving them the drench just to help with, um, getting nutrition while they're still showing signs of the scours. It's not been, it's been hit and miss. Sometimes I come and it's more solid, and the next time I come and it's liquidy again. Um, even with giving the medicine and I've done the maximum amount of time I can give right now so um, I'm doing the apple cider vinegar twice a day to see if that helps build up the good stuff in the in their stomachs so that they can naturally fight it off um, getting hydrated they have started drinking water regularly and I've seen them kind of investigating the feed as well so um, hopefully in the next couple of days they'll start <laughs> she's jumping around um, eating that feed a little more and drinking water more. They they drank probably a third of a, a five gallon bucket full of water. Which one um, is he? This is number one. His little mark is gone, but he had a one right there. I got drench all over you. <laughs> um, we just named them one, two, three, four, five, and six. But they have um, since then. He's he's still number one. But number six is has a puppy drop uh, paw teardrop under his eye, <laughs> so the girl's been calling him teardrop. Um, number three is the black male, and he has um, a heart. See how his white is like really big. His is like a small heart, so we we'll call him love. The black female is called Sally, and um, the one with the V is five and we call him crazy five um the rest just are numbers right now or v i call him v sometimes but you're okay i think that's it i think that's it yep all gone all right so we'll go to the next couple